Hello, I hope you are all really well on this Friday. I wanted to take this opportunity today to share some news and the developments that are happening in Hamworthy and Turlemore, notices if you like, about what has been going on. First of all, I wanted to invite you to church at home on Pentecost Sunday, on Sunday the 31st of May at 10 o'clock. We are going to gather together using Zoom and we're going to do church together. If you would like to be a part of that, please do be in touch and we'll send you the link so you and your family can join in. There's going to be loads of fun as we come together in that way for the first time. Secondly, it is wonderful that we are opening a community food store in Turlemore, in St. Gabriel's Church, on the 2nd of June from 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. It will also be open on a Wednesday afternoon from 5 to 7 p.m. This is a place where you can uh, go and receive food for a very small amount of money. So if you'd like to supplement your food income, please do go. And if you would like to volunteer at the community food store, please do be in touch and we'll put you in front, in, in touch with the right people. Also related to the community food store, Anne Kambata, the community worker on Tillamore, who's doing an amazing job. She's wonderful. She is looking for a large bottle of hand sanitizer. If anybody has one or knows where we can get hold of that, please do let us know so that we can keep the community food store safe as well. And finally, I have some wonderful news to share with you. We have um, another clergy person joining us here in the parish of Hamworthy, Reverend Ashley Ross. She has been gr granted permission to officiate by the Bishop um, in, in our um, diocese and we are so looking forward to her and her husband Dave coming to join us. She will be licensed as an associate priest um, after lockdown is over and we really look forward to being um, a family and, and, and welcoming Dave and Ashley into our church family. And they'll be moving into the area as well. So on Monday, Ashley will be doing the thought for the day. You'll be able to get to know her via Facebook and Instagram and our, our website and YouTube channel. So do look out for her on Monday so you can see who she is and what she looks like. And uh, you're in for a treat as well. And I do hope and pray that as the restrictions lighten a little bit, that you will make great choices. Be sure to stay safe and continue to maintain social distancing during um, a lockdown, even though we have had slight liftings of the, of the restrictions. I am so looking forward to all that we have ahead of us in the next few months. We are having to adapt, but I do hope and pray that you will know the Lord close to you. It says in Psalm 34 that he is close to the brokenhearted. The Lord knows where you're at and what's going on in your life. So look to him. And uh, I do encourage you as I finish off this thought for today to read Nehemiah 7 before Sunday because I'm going to be preaching on that passage. It's got lots and lots of funny names in there and um, I look forward to sharing with you what we can learn about God in that chapter. So have a fantastic weekend. I'll see you Sunday morning. Tomorrow the Archdeacon's going to be sharing a thought for the day. But much love and God bless. Bye.